Welcome to Integrated. This is the podcast where we seek to bridge the gap between the intellect and the will so that we can grow as disciples of Christ, surrendering all that we are and all that we have to the truth. Hey guys, welcome back to Integrated. My name is Angela Erickson, and I am so glad that you are here today. This is my first ever uh, review of something that's been sent to me from a publisher, and I'm so excited about it because this thing is on sale for $10 right now. So I'm going to tell you all about it and why you should buy it, but I'm telling you, and I'll put a link in the bio, you need to go get it like today. Um, So before I get started, I do want to tell you that um, if you could please like this and share it, subscribe, that of course that helps me so much and we'll let other people find out about this too. And, And I really want people to find out about this particular planner because honestly, it's probably one of the best planners I've ever used. And I don't say that lightly at all. Like as a homeschooling mom and someone who's running a podcast and doing all this stuff, it's really hard to find a planner that I like, especially for work-related stuff. And so this calendar is amazing. Like I have it here. I have been using it daily and I am so grateful to Tan for, for sending me this, even though I'm not officially part of their affiliate program. And I want to make that clear. I will be a part of their affiliate program uh, at some point, but they're revamping it for the time being. But honestly, I love this planner so much that I was like, I don't even care that I'm not going to get any sort of like commission for this right now. I just genuinely want people to have this planner because it's amazing. So, okay. The first thing about the Agnes Day calendar, it's a 12 month planner. We have the year 2024, of course, here. And like I said, it's on sale for $10. Go get it. Um, But if you're wanting a little more information about it, like I would, um, let me tell you about it because it's probably one of the most beautiful planners I've actually ever looked at. And the feel of it is amazing. It has this like hard cover exterior and, and the, the cover, like the, the cover actually goes around the spiral bound. It's spiral bound, but it's protected. And so it's not going to fall apart, which I mean, I don't know about you guys, but like my kids get a hold of my stuff all the time and all of a sudden the spirals are like falling halfway out of something or if I'm moving it a lot between like traveling with, with a planner of some sort or whatever, um, those spiral bound plan, like spiral bound planners or books, we have a lot of them for homeschooling. They just don't generally hold up, even though they tend to turn the pages better. Um, and so I, I honestly, I love that. I love that it's protected. Now, the next thing I want to talk about is... Um, all of the things that it has in here, like you can write down your reading list for the year, Um, more information about saints. Like there's so much information in here about the saints. Uh, It tells you their feast days. It tells you about days that uh, we are going to be fasting and what, what the penitential observances are for those, those days of fasting. Uh, It actually has a whole list too of patron saints. Like, so on one, at first you have the, the list of the saints and their feast day. And then you you keep flipping and it transitions to patron patronages, excuse me. So like you would say you're looking for, you know, throat. You you look up throat on, on the, the left side in bold, and then on the right side, you'd see St. Blaze. I mean, all that stuff. So when you're really, really looking for spiritual help and you're you're like, who's the saint of this thing? You're probably gonna find it because it's a very extensive list here. Next, move, as you move forward, what I, okay, oh my gosh, I, I, there are so many features that I genuinely, genuinely love. I'm like flipping through, I'm flipping through mine right now, and I just am like, I'm so impressed with how organized it is. But it has, for each month, which maybe the only thing I could see improving would be maybe putting this with each month somehow, but not really because... Um, what I'm, what I'm trying to get to is that they have listed for each month, uh, the, the most prominent novena for that month. So like, for example, for January, we just got done with the novena to, uh, the holy name of Jesus. And so that novena is listed. Then under that you have February's novena. Um, and you, you go through all of this stuff for each month. And it has it all there for you, which is amazing. You don't have to go looking for it. And if you're like planning out your day and you're, you're writing out what you've got going on for the day or for the calendar month, then you can just flip back and pray your novena for the day and you don't have to go looking for it, which I really love. Um, The other thing that I really like is that the monthly calendars 
they're actually compiled together. So it's not like January, you get the month calendar and then you go into the days of January. Then you get the February overlook and then you get the February days. You actually get all of the month's overviews together. So January, then February, March, April, May, and you go through the whole year, which is so nice for me because if I'm planning interviews, I kind of like to just have an overview of, of where I'm going for the next couple of months. And so when I'm writing it out, it's nice to flip through and say, oh, I've got this day open. And I've got this day open. I, have, I don't have to like go through the whole calendar, like flip through a bunch of pages to go find where my next interview date is going to be. So I really love that. And then you get into like these full color pages for um, for each day. Like this, all, the paper quality is amazing. The color, it's beautiful. It's a beautiful planner front to back. Um, and each page, it has a saint and a portrait, like a painting, some sort of artwork depicting a saint. And then it gives a bio of that saint and you're going to be selling, celebrating the saint at some point that week. Um, it's just really amazing. I'm so impressed with this calendar. And uh, I really hope that uh, if you guys are interested in this, maybe, maybe I should do a, I'm going to share my screen with you for a minute and show you, um, what it kind of looks like, give you a better idea. And then you can decide for yourself, but I seriously recommend it, especially for 10 bucks. Like what are you, what are you going to lose? Honestly? So let's look at this. Here's a calendar. This is what it looks like. Like these full color pages here. Here we got the, the assumption of the blessed Virgin Mary. You got the dates here. It has what the feasts are that you're celebrating it has the Novus Ordo or like the new calendar and the traditional calendar listed. You see that little fish on Friday. It reminds you, of course, that you are supposed to be fasting and abstaining from meat on Friday. Um, I really love that. It has major feast days highlighted in bold. Um, and here, like the month, you got your notes section. And so you just have all of those month overviews together. Um, I really, really love that. It has monthly devotionals. Like I said, you've got the liturgical calendar. You, they even have Ember Days listed. I can't remember if I said that or not, but I think that's that's super important because that's sort of a, that's something that we've lost in the church. And, and I'll be the first one to admit, like I've never done Ember Days that well. And, and I always forget and I, like wait until the very last second. And then I go, oh my goodness, it's an Ember, it's an Ember Day. Um, the artwork is seriously beautiful. You can list your monthly intentions in there. I just, I cannot speak highly enough about how beautiful this planner is. So if you've been looking for a planner for this year, seriously, just go ahead and get it. Like 10 bucks, what do you have to lose? Um, and yeah, like that's it. That's it. And you're going to have, you're going to have a great calendar for planning. If you're if you are doing some work and you like to have something that you can glance at pretty quickly, you've got that. If you are if you want your novenas in one place, if you like having all this information about the saints integrated into your calendar in a way that's accessible and you and it's not overwhelming either, um, I just so, so recommend it. So thank you for listening. Um, please, again, share this. Let other people know that they can get an awesome deal right now. Uh, and I'll be sure to post a link in the description. So you can just go buy it for $10. Now, if you looked on the website, um, I think it, the original price is like $35, <laughs> which I mean, that's pretty standard and, and, and that's fine and all, but you can get this for $10. I mean, that's a huge saving there. So go get it. That's what I'm going to say. Go get it. And if you have any questions or comments, if you've used this calendar, please comment below. I would love to hear your thoughts about this calendar. Maybe, maybe if you've used it before, you have, you have other things that you like about it, or if maybe things that you didn't like about using it for the year. I would love to hear that too. Uh, but yeah, I just want to let you guys know about this calendar, especially while it's on sale. So thank you again for listening and God bless you guys. Mm -hmm.